Part 4. Mastery.org. Please visit this website because it's the future of education. It's like badges. Just imagine if you went to a scout meeting and you have to make fire uh, with one match, something like this, or you have to tie knots. You have to have three different types of knots. You either get the badge or next month when they do it again, you get the badge. So three years from now, you've got a badge. The other guy has a badge. You took two months to get it. He got it the first time. But everybody has badges. There's no grade point average. Grades tend to teach lessons, right? I used to do this. You have to get more organized. You have to plan ahead. So maybe this D on this essay will teach you a lesson so that next time you turn in a paper, you'll turn it in on time. Of course, if he turns it in on time and gets a B, he doesn't get a B overall. He's got a C average now. Uh, these people have taught me, let's not use grades to guide people. Let's use the training of skills. So it's a focus on skills, not on grades. You can see some of my work on these links. And that's where I keep my portfolio. Last little tip. Amazon will print any Word document or PDF. This right here is handwritten. They are a set of notes that I put together with a student, and together we made a test prep book. It's for the post-secondary educational readiness test that's used in Florida. It's available, and it, it was free to put up. It cost $3 for each item you can get, um, again, with shipping. Um, the, the shipping has some sort of flat rate, whether you do one book or ten books. And so it works out to be about $2.50, and then there's $5 shipping on top of that. So $30 for 10 books. Interesting thing to put on a portfolio or a website. So I hope you've had a chance now to look at these links. So go ahead. Type in the, the link addresses. Thank you.